Where's my degenerate gamblers at? <laughs> oh man, the lines are out for some of these, uh, for some of the uh, bigger or more interesting games this college football season. My good buddies over at DraftKings have done went ahead and uh, put out some of the lines on some of these games, and uh, some of them are about what maybe you thought they would be. Maybe some of them not so much. And I can tell you right now, after just briefly scanning through some of these games. Uh, the Hill Jacks, our buddies up in Tennessee, the Hill Jacks, they're not going to be too happy about some of these. Let me, uh, <laughs> uh, Florida and Utah, the line is out. What do y'all think that one is? Let, uh, let me, uh, <laughs> let me find the Hill Jacks on here. Well, let's start the Hill Jacks out with some good news. The Hill Jacks are favored over Florida by how much? What do you think? The line is out. How much is Tennessee? It's a road game. It's in Gainesville early in the year. Tennessee versus Florida. How much is Tennessee favored by against the lowly Gators? Maybe the worst team in the SEC. Uh, seven and a half. <laughs> oh, man. Reality might be about to come crashing down on the Hill Jacks. These Tennessee fans, they're going to be besides themselves. Uh, how you doing? Let's keep it moving. Wow, the line for Georgia, South Carolina, through the roof. Um, if you want me to do a video on, on some of these matchups, let me know. Get, uh, mention the games down below you'd like to see me talk about in terms of what the lines are. And maybe I'll make a few more uh, over the course of this weekend. But I, I, I want to look at some of these Tennessee lines in this video. Florida State and Clemson, the line is out on that one. Ohio State, Notre Dame. Uh, UCLA and Utah, Texas, Baylor. South Carolina and Tennessee. Huge re uh, revenge game for the Hill Jacks. South Carolina on the road this time. Uh, had to play this game in Knoxville September 30th. So this will be, what, fourth or fifth game of the year, I guess, for these two teams. Uh, South Carolina will have already gotten skull drugged by Georgia by the time this game is played. Uh, but South Carolina travels to Knoxville uh, Saturday, September 30th. Of course, South Carolina put an absolute beat down on the Hill Jacks last year at the end of the year in Columbia. Would he score 63 points on you? Wow. With Spencer fucking Rattler. Oh, my God. <laughs> Do you know how bad you have to be to give up 63 points to Spencer fucking Rattler? Wow. Tennessee is favored in this one. It's a home game. Let's keep that in mind. You know, Tennessee can't lose at home. Ask any Hill Jack and they'll tell you. Oh, you can't, you can't beat Tennessee at home. Tennessee's a different team at home. So Tennessee's probably favored huge in every single home game this year, I would imagine. <laughs> uh, but how much are they favored by at home against South Carolina? September 30th? 13 points. Wow. Wow. Should be a barn burner. <laughs> Speaking of the barn, Georgia versus Auburn. Georgia plays on the road at Auburn. I believe that's Georgia's first road game of the year, which means that'll be Carson Beck's first road game. And Auburn can be a tough place to play. I don't expect Auburn to be very good. Georgia's favored by 18 and a half on the road over Auburn. But but let's 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 stick with the Hill Jacks. Let's stick with Tennessee. Ooh, Alabama and Texas A&M at Texas A&M. What do you think the spread is on that one? Interesting there. Texas and Oklahoma. You can probably guess who's favored there. Uh, Texas A&M and Tennessee, again, a Tennessee home game, so you know they're probably favored by 100, right? Because just ask any Hilljack, they'll tell you they can't lose at home. Uh, Tennessee is favored over the worst team in the SEC last year at home by 9.5. Tennessee's a 9.5 point favorite over, uh, Jimbo, uh, Jimbo Fisher and, uh, what's the offensive, what's the guys, what's the neck brace guy they brought in, uh, Bobby Petrino? Favorite by nine and a half. Wee! Boy, these are a lot of single digit spreads here. Single seven and a half over Florida. Wow. I, we're talking about the worst teams in the SEC here. And the Hilljacks are single digit favorites. Texas AM and Florida, you're single digit favorites over both of them. Wow. Oregon and Washington. Man, the game's played in Washington. Washington is a one and a half point favorite in that one. That might be, that's one of the games of the year in the Pac-12. Southern Cal and Notre Dame. Notre Dame's actually favored in that one. It's, it's in Notre Dame. Notre Dame's favored. How much do you think they're favored by? Again, if you want to hear me talk specifically about more of these games and, and the point spreads and the lines, comment them down below. I'm just kind of scrolling through here and laughing at the Hill Jacks a little bit. Penn State and Ohio State. At Ohio State, you can probably guess who's favored. 
uh, Utah and Southern Cal. Clemson and Miami, the Taters versus the Hurricanes. Tennessee and Alabama. Wow. Alabama ain't got no offensive line. They ain't got no receivers. They ain't got no quarterbacks. They're bringing in leftover garbage trash from Notre Dame. They lost Will Anderson on defense. Their best player is a true freshman running back. Tennessee had the best year last year they've had since Bill Clinton was president, 1998. Can I get a hashtag 1998 in the comments too? Shout out to the Hill Jacks. Surely Tennessee is favored over Alabama. I mean, hell, they beat Alabama last year, right? Uh, nope. <laughs> Alabama's a double-digit favorite over you. Alabama is a double-digit favorite over the Hill Jacks at home in Tuscaloosa. Alabama, Alabama favored by 10. Wow. Wow. The Hill Jacks can't get no respect. Thought they were really good last year. I don't know what happened here. Georgia and Florida. Holy moly. Is that right? Wow. 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 <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, the poor Gators. Notre Dame and the Taters. Who do you think's favored in that one? Uh, Notre Dame was favored over Southern Cal. That was a home game for Notre Dame. Notre Dame on the road at Clemson. Who's favored in that one? Clemson's favored by four and a half. Again, let me know down below if you want me to talk specifically about any of this year's upcoming games and what the lines are on here, what I think about it. And I'll be happy to do it. LSU and Bama could be the game of the year in the SEC West. You probably, uh, well, Alabama's favored uh, by a touchdown. <sighs> Any more Hill Jack shit in here? Hill Jacks. Oh, my Georgia and Tennessee. Wow. Again, a home game for Tennessee, so I'm sure they're favored by 100. You can just ask any Tennessee fan. Uh, they're not losing at home. <laughs> Nice finger painting, buddy. <laughs> uh, what is this? Uh, Georgia's favored by seven and a half on the road at Tennessee late in the year next to the last game of the regular season. Of course, Georgia's favored. The Hill Jacks just aren't very good. They're not very good. Oh, shit. Clemson and South Carolina. South Carolina beat the Taters last year. Clemson favored on the road in Columbia this year. Texas A&M and LSU, weird game last year. Texas A&M, hard to, I don't know how many people remember this. Texas A&M beat LSU last year at the end of the season. Texas A&M was terrible. LSU won the West. Didn't matter. Texas A&M spanked them. LSU still favored this year by 10 and a half. Ohio State and Michigan. Michigan's won two games in a row against Ohio State. They've won the Big Ten two years in a row. They've made the playoffs two years in a row. They've just made Ryan Day and the Suck Nuts their bitch the last two years. This is a home game for Michigan. And they're favored again. They're favored by two and a half over Ohio State. Poor Ryan Day. Wow. Iron Bowl. Alabama favored by 14 over Auburn. Florida State and Florida. Florida State favored by nine and a half. Florida State is favored... Florida State's favorite to beat Florida worse than Tennessee is. Tennessee is only a seven and a half point favorite over Florida. Florida State's a nine and a half point favorite over Florida. Seems like the Hill Jacks just get no respect. I don't understand it. Anyway, let me know if there's some of these games you want to hear about down below. And let me know what you think about the lines on some of these Tennessee Hill Jack games. Have a great day.